Hi. Thank you for watching my video. I am uploading my videos to share with you what impressed me on astrophotography activities. This time, I'm sharing my story of modifying an altazimuth mount transformed to a motor-driven equatorial mount. Controlled from my Raspberry Pi Python program. The altazimuth mount is the K-Type 1 designed by Mizar. It is a long seller model. Because the original company went bankrupt. Now it is sold from Mizar Tech. Where I bought it from. The two warm Gayard axes are driven with stepping motors that are controlled from the Raspberry Pi. I built a simple tkinter program in Python. I have spent a few months completing this project. Let's see how it went through. First, I started wiring the motor driver. I use the GPIO ports only for this purpose. So I directly soldered the wires to this 40 pin connector. After I checked the stepping signals passed, I connected the motor operating in 5 volts. I did the same things for another motor too. Once all the wires were soldered, I put hot melt to secure the connections. I checked the two motors controlled independently from my Raspberry Pi box. The next thing I did was to modify the gears. The smaller gears were for the motor shafts. The larger gears were for the warm gear axis of the altazimuth mount. Then I modified some metal parts to connect the motors to the mount. I spent a few weeks finding the right parts in a DIY shop. Because there are no mounting screw holes on the mount, I used epoxy glue to attach the parts. I inserted springs to the motor's base parts so the gear teeth fit together securely. I got the springs from the wooden clothespins. I had to reform them but the springs work just perfectly. Then I cut the signal wires to insert DB connectors between the motors and the Raspberry Pi box. It's getting closer to completion. All the electronics should be packed into a box. I spent another few weeks finding this perfect sized box in a $1 shop. The DB connector and the motor driver boards perfectly fit into the box. The box was then screwed onto the mount. The motors are not covered with any enclosures. That is the one thing I want to work on later on. Finally I got everything functioning. The telescope is the Newtony I modified. How I modified it was posted previously. If you would like to know. Please check the link in the description. I think this is something I have longed to accomplish for a long time. A tiny observatory could be this. I hope I will soon post the demonstrations in the field. That's all for this time.
Thanks for watching this video. See you next time.